Hello everyone, welcome to IMT Gaming and welcome back to Banjo Tooie. Last time we were exploring more of the icy areas of the Hailfire Peaks. We managed to take out the Ice Dragon. And now I'm just looking around for anything else that I may have missed. For example, over in this, in the higher regions, there was this lake that I noticed that there was a ginger at the bottom. And I can go get him, like so. Along with a fried fish for Boggy. And just like that, we got two birds with one stone. Now let's just get up this ramp out of the lake. And I'll bring you guys back when I'm at Boggy's. It's actually going to be a little slow with Banjo when he's on his own. Okay, and here we are back at Boggy's house. Right. And there's our old friend. Oh. Oh. How did he eat a jiggy? What, what was that? Wow, the fish must have swallowed a jiggy. Oh, well, that makes more sense. Well, if it's not edible, I don't want it. Fair enough, Boggy. I'll add it to our collection. Be my guest. I got stuff to watch. Alright. 46 Jiggies now. Right, we're pretty much done around Boggy's place. At least I think so. Yeah, I think we're done. Now... Let's get Kazooie over here, because we actually need to vi visit Humble Wumba again to become a snowball. I wish that enemies would give up honeycombs automatically like they used to in the first game, but what can you do? Alright, Kazooie, get your butt over there. There we go. Right. Onward to Humbuzz. Transformation time. got to do it is that we got to go up one of these ramps or I could just go up the hill make sure that we got plenty of health though Try to take a path through the other side, or Ooh. 
Now let's see if we can go up through here. Zinjo, come back and do a little damage. Thank you. Going down. Yeah, this is not the route to go. Wonder if I can take the teleporter. Yeah, through the upper area. This is more like it. Now let's see. Am I heavy enough? Yeah, not quite heavy enough. Let's try that again. Alright, try again. Whoops. I goofed. I screwed up. I'll bring you guys back in a minute. Alright, we made it this time with full health. That's more like it. Yeah. Easy does it. What do you got for me? You keep bouncing around in there. Basement. Waste disposal plant. Grunty Industries. That's where I'm gonna have to go get that one. I wonder if maybe there's a sh I could take the shortcut and maybe transform back and then go get it. switch back to Banjo and Kazooie and see what we can do.
Okay, we are back. And can we... No, I guess we cannot. I'm really curious. What makes me curious is that this door looks like it can be opened. Hmm. I'm gonna have to do a little more exploring. I'll bring you guys back in a sec. Okay, so we're back in the Icicle Grotto. And we're doing a little more exploring around the zone. Because apparently there's a lot more in here that I may have missed. For one thing, a new teleportation pad. Look around and... Oh cool, my path from last time is still here. <laughs> Get it? Ice? Cool. Yeah, I know what that deserves. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I know, that was bad. I just call him like I see him. And let me see. What else? Oh, there's a, one of those bigger note things over there. And there's a ginger up there. This area looks like it's going to belong to Kazooie. So let's split up. It's all you, Kazooie. Oh, shoot. That's no good. I'm a goner. Going down. Can I help it if you jump too far? Alright, dang it. I did it again. I'm really bad at those really narrow jumps. It doesn't help that it's so, that it's so slippery in here. I should have just kept going. I'll try it again. At least I got the jump down, I think. Okay, I got a plan. Join up again. Fire. Okay, Kazumi. Try this again. Oh. No, 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 no. I'll bring you guys back in a second. And we finally got it. 705 notes. Now I gotta get that ginger that's up there. Yep, I'm gonna have to glide over to, to that ginger. So, let's go back up the steps. There we go. And if we fly straight across.
Oh, are you serious? Come on. Oh, no, 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 not this time. Not this time. Out of the way. Careful. Got the Jinjo. <laughs> I love it when a plan comes together. And let's head up this swing. another tunnel here it looks like let's see where this goes all right Can actually hit those guys. Oh, I got him finally. I got that little turd. Although I don't think I've been able to figure out exactly where the train station is. Yeah, I'm gonna try to look for the train station here and we'll hitch a ride and we'll head over to Grunty Industries. There's that thing I learned from Jam Jars last time. Wait a minute, what's that over there? Time for some splitting action. All right, we're we're in the air and we're going down. Nice and easy, like we got a Cheeto page. Excellent. All right. Now it's time to find out exactly where the train station is around here. I'll do a little looking around and find and bring you guys back when we find it. Okay, I finally did some looking around and it looks like I managed to find the entrance to the fiery side of the train station. Oh, and that hurt. Jeffy is on freight service to Grunty Industries. Yeah, I have it open the the passway passage open anyway, so Aha, there was a honeycomb up there. I'm gonna get it. a lot easier than I thought it'd be. 
Not as easy as getting out of the lava, though. Is there anything in, over here of interest? Hmm. No, it doesn't look like it. Oh well. I'll do a little more looking around and see if I can find the switch for the lava side. Or better yet, still find the way to the ice side of the tracks. Okay, inside the volcano there seems to be an area that I overlooked. So we gotta step on these panels. Mobile unlimited air supply too. Gonna make it, but at least I got the jiggy. I'm gonna try that again to see what that those signs say. I hope I don't have to flip all those switches again, though. I'll bring you guys back when I'm there. Okay, so it looks like I don't have to flip all the switches again, which is a relief. Cold in the skull and wigum. Only a ball of great size can start the oil drill. When things get too hot, remember your bearded buddy. All right. All right. So we got. So that's a clue. I wonder, could one of the switches for the train be in, like, Mumbo's house, or? I don't know, but I'm gonna go figure it out. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, we're in Mumbo's house again. And I'm just looking around for anything that could be of use. Maybe it's behind his, his throne? Or his chair or whatever? And there is absolutely nothing here. Yep, nothing here. Still looking. Aha! I found another switch. Let's see what this does. Haha! -ha! Now let's get over to the train station and bring Chuffy on over. Whoops, I think I might have goofed. Oof. That did a number on me. I gotta find some health fast. Are you a real Jinjo or? Nope. Lighter? I don't think so. And apparently there's a way to connect. I'm gonna burp about that. Found a deposit of eggs. Way to connect two worlds again. So it looks like I'm gonna have to rebring my uh, stone statue self back through these ways. For now, though, I wonder what else is going on up here. there's any rubber shoes in here. Probably behind those cracks. Hold tight. Aha! What's this? Ooh! There's a way to that, Jinjo, now. And I'll do a little exploring around here real quick, and I'll bring you guys back in a sec. Going up this way just to see what happens. What oh, awaits us at the top?
Oh, a Cheeto. Yeah, a Cheeto page. Cool. And I think that was it up here. Yes, no, maybe so. This is clearly something for Banjo to do. So how's he gonna get over here? I don't see a doorway over there. Maybe there's another path for him to take. I'll do a little more looking around and bring you guys back in a sec. All right, I'm over at where this Jinjo was able to be reached now. And I guess the bag isn't scalding waterproof in that case. So, I wonder if I could actually get over there with the, in the invincible feathers. Yeah, I'll head on over there real quick and bring you guys back in a sec. Okay, we're back up in this spot. So I wonder if maybe there's a spot for them to switch. It looks like there is, but I don't know how to get to that. And there's a Jiggy in there too. You know what? I think I'm going to treat everybody here to a game of kickball. Since this episode's actually been kind of lagging, so I'm going to do something that m might be considered fun. Hold tight. I'll bring you guys back when we're in our stony form. Alright, we're back. And we're going to have some fun. Welcome to the Coliseum Professional Kickball Championships. We like to do things a little differently here. The lowest score always wins. We're just about to begin the quarterfinals. Okay, so... Here you want to keep your score at the lowest in order to win. This ain't the Mayan League now. May the best stony win. Oh, no, you don't. Let's try that again. May the best stony win. I plan to. through with only four points. You've won your quarterfinal. 
Now you may move on to the semifinals. Let's do that. You're playing with the big boys now. Playing with the big boys now. <laughs> Reminds me of that song from Prince of Egypt. Oh, I just realized what I need to be doing here. This one isn't going to count because I messed up at the start. Let's try that again. This time, focus. So we start off with high points here, but we got to get rid of them with the red balls. Close one, though. Try again. Focus. Once again. Yeah, let's try again. I'll bring you guys back when I'm close to getting the lowest score. Yes! Finally, a one! You've won your semi final. The Coliseum Kickball final awaits. Well, let's do it. You'll never be the Coliseum Champion. That's what you think.
Let's try this again. This time it's all for nothing. All or nothing, I mean. do this. We can do this. Nuts! It was a tie! No matter. It is doable. We can do this. Come on. Sorry if I got really quiet, I'm just really focusing on the game. That was a lucky catch there. And yes! We are the Kickball Champions. I declare you the new Coliseum Kickball Champion. Did we get a trophy? Of course. <laughs> they think it's all over. <laughs> Sweet. We got us a new Jiggy. Now, I'm actually going to go switch back to Banjo and Kazooie. I'll bring you guys back soon. Alright, we are back, and we're back in the train station as well. Alright. Yes, we would like Chuffy to pick us up. get to the ice side, we gotta give Chubby some water. And the only one who can do that is Gobi. So, let me see. I just gotta remember how to get back over to him. Alright. Alright, I finally found my way back to over to where Gobo was. I hate to do this, T-Guy, but we need your water. Oh no. 
It took me since the last game to save that. Ah, uh, yes, that seems to have cooled my boiler enough. I'll let you take the chuffin' train to the ice side now. Whoops. I'll get this way up into the train from this side. Oh, come on. painful way. Alright. There we go. Yeah, now you'll climb up into there. Alright. Over to the ice side we go. Found the way in. God, this looks interesting. Doesn't look like there's much of anything if it's in the water. Let's go up here. Seriously, another one? Ah, guys. Oh, well, at least I start right back off at Chuffy, not back at the beginning of the level. What's through here? Aha! Another jiggy. Perfect. Yeah, go away. Alright. There's still a lot I gotta do in this level, but I think we've done enough of the Hailfire Peaks for now. I'm going to take the train and we're going to leave this episode right off going to Grunty Industries. And away we go. I'm going to leave this episode here. When we come back, we'll be exploring a little bit more of Grunty Industries, getting us some jiggies, and seeing if we can make some progress in some of the other worlds that we've left behind. So, I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more content. Be sure to follow me on Twitter. I'll be leaving a link in the description below. And as always, I'll be seeing you guys next time. Catch you later.